must keep my footing. I must keep my footing. I must tread carefully. I must tread carefully to make sure no one usurps my position. No one usurps my position. Hold fast to my wife and children and house and garden and lawn and tools. Life following the example I set for it will once again flow into me. I suppose I caught a chill from being in the damp air. We'll switch on the fire. I'll get the children to bed. <laughs> yes.
countries more favorable than any other for his recovery. A pleasant climate, healthy outdoor life. He gets a good wage, we've plenty to eat, we've our own.
good to see you back. Yes, indeed. Fair is fair. Yes, indeed. What I mean to say yes, is that you indeed. won't think me unfair yes, or victimizing indeed. if I explain that the department is worried. Yes, indeed. It's like this. Yes. Mr. Rainbird, Godfrey. We've taken advice on this. In the interests of the tourist business of the country as a whole, not to mention our overseas exchange, we've taken advice. In those interests, Godfrey, Especially in the wider public interest, and that of the tourist image. Ours is a public service, Mr. Rainbow. If a man disgraces himself, is brought before the court, goes to prison, we can't continue to employ him. Mind you, it's not that we don't believe in the rehabilitation of the criminal. It's just that there are other organizations more willing and able to cope with them. Public image. We have to remember that our image is a public image. Understand me. You're a fine, clean living young man. You've adapted yourself well to this country. The fact is, what happened last week was a terrible thing. I sent a wreath to your wife. I'd like you to know that. I offered my personal help to her. We're not stony hearted. Family and the wolf at the door. 
sun has gone in I'll try the want ads in the star tonight Mechanic, no remittance car salesman, mail clerk, automotive electrician, boy or youth, four hat factory, handyman, married couple for sheep run, experienced shift man for state coal mines, good reliable man for window cleaning, married tractor driver, heating engineer with ability, foresight, initiative, pipe fitters, man for lube bay, tunnelers, insurance executive, sheet metal tradesman, chief clerk, jobbing compositor, first class. Somewhere within the area covered by this newspaper, a man will read this advertisement to start himself on a new successful career. He will be a man with drive, enthusiasm, high in intelligence, and a determination to get the higher income bracket. Rabbiter, experienced or man willing to learn, program covers poisoning, trapping, light shooting, experienced lounge bar singer, would considered married couple with wife as waitress, working for General Coal Yard, married man preferred, three apprentices in bindery department, men for store, flower millers, experienced cutters, elevator operator at hotel. Have you integrity? Perseverance, enthusiasm. The job includes portering, early morning teas, receiving late guests, daytime control of the lift. The hours are irregular. Have you done this kind of work before? I haven't. It helps to be well spoken, though we are against too much la di da talk putting on the style. We don't want any Lord Ha Ha's working for us. Personal appearance is important. We have a lot of overseas visitors here. We used to have royalty. 
but now they go to the superior up the road where they have private lavatories and baths. You have a wound on your cheek, car accident. Hell yes! We don't like a man who's had his license endorsed. Oh, it's nothing like that. I can't drive. I think I've seen your face before. You're the bloke who died and came back to life. Yes, I am. Now, we have a humanitarian tradition here at the Pioneer. We've often given our man's job to someone who's, you know. We've had a variety of good workers here. They may not have had much in the top story, but they've learned how to run the elevator and give good advice, and they've been decent, honest, well-spoken. We always say that something must be done for the handicapped. Therefore, because we do have this tradition of helping the Handicapped. Those who may not have been born with the normal equipment, so to speak. I'm prepared to take you on shift work starting at 9 o'clock tomorrow morning. No one can say we do nothing for the handicapped. Mr. Collins, this is his wife speaking. I am afraid that Godfrey has found something else.
manager, sorry, but thank me for calling. Fear of death, fear of intensity. We will get back to normal, Godfrey. I'm going back to work for the doctor. I had an uncle who had a heart attack. He gave up his job and stayed at home sharpening scissors and knives. People always need scissors and knives. But I'm not an invalid. Of course you're not. But in a way, it's not really fair of you to go back to work. Not fair. Who's talking of fairness? You have to give people a chance, Godfrey. A chance to live, a chance to know they're alive, that they're being pronounced alive is no mistake. We didn't dream what's happened. You understand it's only natural, only human for people not to want to be reminded. They might get so angry that they would persecute you. They might even kill you. They might even kill you, Godfrey. Don't you see that they want peace? I'll get a job. You stay home. Perhaps grow vegetables. It sounds cruel. But life's cruel. If it's me, I'm going north. I arranged it yesterday. I have no cause to stay. No cause. No Woo!